Attention, you will need a jailbroken iDevice with iOS 4 or above for this to work. If your iDevice is not jailbroken, you can click on the screen below or follow the link in the description. Hey, what's up? Operation iDroid here, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get a Game Boy or Game Boy Color emulator on your iPhone or iPod Touch. So let's get started. First thing we're going to do is open Cydia. And once Cydia loads, we are going to go ahead and add a source. And to add a source, we are going to click on the Manage tab. Then on the top right hand corner, Edit. Top left hand corner, Add. And we are going to type in the Insane the Eye repo, which goes as follows. Repo.insanetheye.com Then we are going to go ahead and click on Add Source. It's going to verify the URL and then we are going to click on add anyway and then once we click on add anyway it will add the source it will do everything it needs to do and once it is finished we will click on return to Cydia step 2 now once we have returned to Cydia we are going to go into the search tab and we are going to search for Game Boy for iPhone. So we are going to search that and we are going to click on Game Boy for iPhone. This is the actual Game Boy emulator that we are going to be using. So click on install and then we are going to click on continue queuing because we are going to be getting other packages. So now let's go back to the search and now we are going to search for Safari Download Manager. And once we search this, you'll see that we now have two Safari download managers, the actual paid tweak and the insanely I crack tweak. And I recommend that you go ahead and get the paid tweak. I'm not going to go, go ahead and get it now because it's going to be a long process to put in my information. So I'm just going to install the crack tweak so you guys can learn how to install it by clicking install continue queuing so if you guys want to try it out before you go ahead and buy it which I recommend you do buy and now we are going to go back and search for GBC, GBC Pokemon and this is a Pokemon ROMs pack because I know that Pokemon games are extremely popular especially in the Game Boy and Game Boy Color emulator realm and this package comes with Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow, Gold, Silver and Crystal so go ahead click on install and confirm and now you can see where it says install all the stuff that we just got so this should not take too long um, it took me about five minutes I speeded this up so it would not take time from the video but you can go ahead and pause it and continue when it is done installing everything because when it is done we're going to have to restart the springboard step three once we've restarted the springboard look for a GB for iPhone on your springboard it looks like this and we're gonna go ahead and open it and now you'll see that we have all the ROMs that were listed in the GBC in the GBC Pokemon ROMs pack and now you may be wondering how do I get other games that aren't Pokemon games so we're gonna go ahead and go into Safari and we're gonna search coolrom.com this way we can get one specific game that you might want to get so once coolrom.com opens we're gonna search in the ROM search for the title that we want to get so as an example, I am going to search for Link's Awakening, a Game Boy game. And once I type it in here in the search, I'm going to click on the little magnifying glass or I can click go to search for it. As you can see, it has found two things. I'm going to click on Zelda Link's Awakening and it will take me to the page of Zelda Link's Awakening ROM. And when you scroll down, you'll see all its information. And then the most important part is the download now at the bottom. So go ahead and click that to download the game that you want. Then once you click on it, this screen will appear. Click on Downloads. And then from here, we're going to go back to Media at the top left-hand corner. Then we're going to scroll down, click on ROMs, and then Game Boy. And here at the bottom right, we're going to click Choose. And when we get back to this screen, click Download. And now this download should not take too long. It took me like five seconds. Then we're going to click on that icon on the bottom. And as you can see, we have downloaded Zelda Link's Awakening. Step four. Let's go back into Cydia. And this only applies to people trying to get specific games. If you're content with the Pokemon games, then you don't have to go back to Cydia and do everything that we've been doing. Anyways, now we're going to search. 
and in the search tab we are going to search for iFile and it is the blue application go ahead and click on that and then click on install at the top right hand corner and then this is the only application that we're going to be getting so now we can click on confirm and we're going to install iFile this will take about two minutes I fast forwarded so it doesn't take time away from the video so you can pause and come back when you are done getting iFile let's return to Cydia go back into our springboard and into step 5 now as you can see I have iFile in my springboard go ahead and open it and now we're gonna go into var mobile you should be there if not click on the house at the bottom right and now we're gonna click on the folder media scroll down folder ROMs and then the folder Game Boy and then now you'll see whichever game you got it should be a zip file so as you can see that was Zelda's Link's Awakening dot zip and then click on unarchiver and then it will click done at the top and now we have Zelda's Link's Awakening dot GB because it is a Game Boy game step six let's go back into the GB for iPhone application go ahead and open it and now you'll see you have the game that you wanted in the actual game so as you can see I had Zelda's Link's Awakening there and it is working perfectly and now I'm going to show you some stuff about the actual application by clicking in the top middle section we go to this screen and you can save or save a new state or you can quit and save whichever you like there are also options in the GB for iPhone application with different skins here I'm going to show you skin 2 and now I'm going to try getting playing another game that I have here and I'm going to play in portrait and no sound. You guys can play in any orientation that you like. I'm using this one just for the video. As you can see, this is now a different skin that was we used from before. So I'm going to go back into the GB iPhone. I'm going to go back into skin 1. And now I'm going to show you in actual landscape because you can also play in landscape. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please click on that green subscribe button to see more cool videos like this one or the ones on your screen. I have a couple of videos here that you can either click on to watch or follow the links on the description. Thank you for clicking that green subscribe button and welcome to the operation.